Hey, what's going on everyone? My name is SK4 and welcome to a tutorial on how to change your like the name of your worlds in single player. So here are some examples. So there's many different things that you can do to format the name of your world. So there's rainbow. You can like customize the text by changing its colors and also have like italic, underline, bold, random letters. Uh, even Unicode works like this so yeah let's get started so the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna create a new world so let's click here and let's call it that's okay for so let's call it swag 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 no let's let's actually call it swag 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 one two three four five yeah so let's make it a creative world enable sheets and create a new world and um it's building terrain right now so let's wait a little bit shouldn't take too long should take a while though um and there we go so now that we have whoa nice biome i like this nice whoa this looks pretty good um <laughs> yeah anyway let's not go off topic let's close this world and then let's uh, exit it to the go to like the title menu I don't know why it's lagging so much. It's gonna take a while. Yeah, so I'll be right back when my Minecraft starts loading again. Alright, so apparently my Minecraft just randomly like crashed, so... Anyway, um, yeah, so now we have a new world, so let's go to single player. And then here, here it is. Swag, 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 one, two, three, four, five. So now we can like, uh, rename it to anything we want. This is a basic, like old days like it's very basic so you can rename it to anything we want we can't customize its color or like anything let's let's actually call it um wait I have to, yeah so let's call it a minecraft world and then rename it but this thing was but if you know if you can see this it will stay the same so there is a way to fix it for those who are wondering so we can still go to our Minecraft launcher. Um, it should take a while. I will show you how to customize the text later, like very very soon. So I just want to show this first, and then we can go to Edit Profile, um, and then Open Game Directory. It works for both Mac and Windows. And then we can go to Saves, and then here where it says Wax 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 One Two Three Four Five. We can change it to anything we want. So let's change it to um, YOLO swag, YOLO swag. Yeah, okay, so um, cancel and then go back here. And then now it should say YOLO swag, YOLO swag. And it says a, mi a Minecraft world in just very boring white text. So let's fix that. So first of all, you need to download the NBT Explorer. So the all six of these links that you will need later will be in the description so just look in the description so yeah um, download it if you're a Mac user then just download the Mac version and same thing for Windows and yeah so just download it so once you have it downloaded just open it right away um, and there it is that's what it looks like so yeah so click on a drop down menu thing I don't know what we call it just the arrow thing and Find YOLO swag, YOLO swag, then drop down, and you just see level dot data. I mean level dot dat d a t. Yeah. So click on it, and then click on this, and look at this. So keep scrolling down until you see the one that says level colon a Minecraft world. I mean level name colon a Minecraft world, and then we're gonna click edit. So here's where we can like customize the text with like many different things we can like add in the colors we can add in the different formatting like bold italic underline so um yeah so here's where the other two websites come in handy so there's these two websites for the color codes so for example let's copy this you want gold um i don't have to copy that i can just type it so this symbol will be in the description and you can also copy it from the Minecraft wiki as well if you don't know how to get it on your keyboard. So let's type a Minecraft world and then click on OK. And here's the, and it will make a 
gold text or like an orange text that says a Minecraft world. And don't forget to click on save. Many people forgot to click on save and would and if you don't click on save it, it would not update. So go to cancel, go to single player again, and look at that. It says a Minecraft world a Minecraft world in like gold text. It looks like orange to me, but yeah. So that was just like a very basic example. You can like go here. I will leave all the links in the description. So you can get like many different cool unicodes. These are like text, they're not pictures. And they will like they will act as like a text and, and they like you can put them in the title. Which is really cool. So these are called unicodes. Uh, you can use it to like just make your just make your world more fancy I guess. So if you search stars, there's many different unicodes for star let's Let's actually use this. I really like this. So, um, let's go to the NBT Explorer and let's click on Edit and let's actually um, add a star paste. There we go. We have like a star thing and let's go back to this color guide and let's make it gray. So I want it to be so the color code for gray is, is seven. So let's type this weird symbol thing. I don't know what we call it. Seven. And there we go. So let's do the same for this side. And wait, um, paste. And there we go. So now, oh wait, 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 forgot to save. Yeah. So let's cancel and go back to single player. And there it is. There's this Unicode. It depends on your like your resource pack, like how the text shows. Apparently, my resource pack doesn't really support Unicode Unicode so well, so it looks kind of weird. But yeah, you can follow many different formatting. You can like have many different colors. For example, um, what should I? Yeah, for example, redstone creation. Let's um, where is it? Where is it? Yeah. So let's look at. Here's like an example. So you can like do this. It's very basic. So you have this symbol and then the code. Like, if you want it to be a color, then like choose any color, and then. There's many, and there's also bold, underlined, italic, magic, strike, and reset. So, um, yeah, so magic is like, like this weird, weird random letters thing, and reset is for like, just have like a space, like this underline, you don't, you don't want there to be a space, like you don't want there to be an underline between this, so, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure if that makes sense, I don't even know if I ever make sense, anyway, yeah, there's also another website you can use to like format it. You can go to here and um yeah, just rainbow text. I know I spelled rainbow wrong. Um uh, a Minecraft world change text. This will make like it, will, it would do the thing for you. It would just make it. This will say a Minecraft world if we put it in the title except it uses this like symbol instead of the correct one, so Let's go to this website, and of course, um, it should be it should be like blank when you first go to it. So you want to type this here, and then replace it with this symbol. And then you can go here and then just paste it. And then find, click on find and replace text. This symbol will be in the description just in case. And it, and you can also like copy it from the wiki, like a Minecraft thing. Yeah, so. Now that we've replaced it, now that now it works for that Minecraft thing, so let's go to YOLO swag, YOLO swag, level dot data, and then yeah, and then and then replace this boring text with some rainbow. So let's paste. There we go. Okay, save. And then if we cancel, it should be some rainbow text. That is awesome. I love it. And um. We can still do something more to it. We can um, add some bow to it. So if we want it to be bold, we can type. Here's just an example. Um, some red text. We can have for bold. We can just type the symbol and then ow and then any text after that. So potato. Yeah. Save it. Cancel. And there we go. We have the bold red text that says potato. And if we want it to be an underline, we can go to the NBT flower, edit the text, and let's see. Let's look at this. Um, let's look at the color guide. So if we want it to be 
underline we we do n so let's press to n save it cancel single player and now we have the underline so now we want uh, italic let's edit add the symbol and then wait where what is it yeah oh so okay save cancel single player and now we have the italic text really cool um if, we're, if we want the magic will mess up your text if we want the strike through let's uh it will be m so let's go to edit i think you get the point by now but I, i'm just gonna keep doing this just because i'm weird <laughs> yeah so save it and then cancel single player and there's a strike through so yeah um and if you add a reset it will just like ignore whatever you did before just an example uh, like if you add it at the end like this it's, it's there's many different purpose for the reset but yeah we just like reset the formatting to just simple white text and yeah so let's remove the reset because we don't want it but let's actually test out this magic so it should be K the letter K let's press it okay save this will like mess up your text just only for the yeah so Here's a bunch of random letters that keep changing. Really cool. And I think you I think you should understand like how this works by now. If you have any question, don't forget to leave any of your questions down in the comments below. And these six websites that you would need will be in the description. Um and yeah, I think that's it. Oh yeah, one more thing. Um my birthday was on January 14. Today is January 22 for me. So, um, thank you to everyone who said happy birthday. It means a lot to me. And also, my channel's first anniversary, is it called the first or second? I started like exactly one year ago. So yeah, it should be my first anniversary on January 25th of 2015. So, or 2015. I don't know how you say it, but yeah. Uh, just just be ready for a good video just like like happy anniversary or something will, will make me feel good so if you learned something new in this video please leave a like and also favorite the video share the video um just do whatever a like will be greatly appreciated and also um if you're new to my channel and have learned something new as well please do subscribe for more uh, video for more videos like these and um uh, is there anything else yeah, so if you have any, any, any questions, just leave a comment. And that's it. I ho hope you learned something new. And I'll see you in the next video. See you. Bye.